Um, Henry Thomas, who was also known as Ragtime Texas, that was his uh, little moniker. And he played the, the song, you might, you, you might recognize the melody. Um, not the words, the words are different, but uh, uh, there's a, it might even be fair, I think it's really early in the, in the movie about Woodstock, that this, you'll hear it, it, this song. And the, the melody is played on a, on a flute on that, but the original, Henry Thomas, he played guitar with a, a set of panpipes. He thought panpipes oh, yeah. were like just zamphir, but no. This is different. There was, apparently panpipes is one of those instruments that uh, is very ancient and is found on every continent. Um, and, uh, and including North America and the... Uh, the it was a, it was a, a an African American instrument uh, that got kind of replaced by the harmonica at a certain point, and and, there's a, and one of, there aren't that many recordings of it. But Henry Thomas is one of them. He made commercial recordings in the late twenties, which uh, must have sold reasonably well because they asked him back. Unlike Mississippi John Hurt, they asked they did ask him back once quickly for a short session, and then nothing really happened. But Henry Thomas, I think he did sell a few records. Uh, with his, with his, the panpipes were known as quills. That's what they called them in the south, in the deep south. So you, you might recognize this melody. It was a good song. Call me, now be gone. 